For this Tabata sequence, we're gonna be performing two lower body exercises. I am going to grab a light dumbbell to perform both exercises. The dumbbell is optional, totally up to you. Exercise number one, you're gonna hold that dumbbell up. If you're using one, you got goblet side to side squat. So for 20 seconds, it's squat, step, squat, step, squat, step. Alternating back and forth. Notice how when I get into that squat, Regular squat rules apply. So toes pointed out anywhere from 15 to 30 degrees. My knees, toes, hips all sort of aligned as I do so. I'm loading up this one leg that I'm stepping out with, maybe 60%, 40% on the other side, and then stepping back to that other side. 20 seconds of your side to side squats, 10 seconds of rest, and then I'm gonna take this dumbbell and I'm going skaters. Just leaning over, pushing back, leaning over, pushing back, leaning over. Now, adding a dumbbell to skaters definitely makes them quite a bit more challenging. One of the biggest things with a skater is that when you land, toes, knees, hips all stay aligned. You have that good alignment. You're able to catch yourself as you do so. Load up the hips as you go. You have the option again to use a dumbbell or to forego the dumbbell. It's gonna be 20 seconds of your side to side squats, 10 seconds of rest, 20 seconds of your skaters, 10 seconds of rest, repeated four times each. So four rounds total, four minutes to complete your Tabata.